Everyone, I'm Alfred. Welcome back to Oblivion. Oh man, is it happening? I advise you to keep your distance from that accursed portal. <laughs> Count Indoris has ordered us to hold our positions until Fairwind returns from inside that accursed Oblivion gate. Haven't you? Yeah. Well, then you know what they're capable of producing. About two days ago. He's been in there with two days. In two son. days. The count fears the worst, and has posted guards here so we can watch and see if anyone comes back out. At this point, Count Indaris is offering. If you find him, or the rest. Okay. Yeah, I kind of figured. Sorry, I'm skipping through his dialogue because, like, what could he possibly even be saying? You know. Um, Indoris. I didn't comment on that guy's name. Well. But it's, of course, reminiscent of Indoril. Like Indoril Nerevar. Oh, shit. I didn't repair any of my things, did I? Yep, sure didn't. Indoril Nerevar, of course, being the anticipation of the Nereverine, the main character of uh, Morrowind. <laughs> All right. What well, fire salts? Hell yeah. Whoa, that looks finished. Yeah, yeah, come on. <laughs> I I am aware that I could be running Oblivion at higher settings than this, and that part of this is just because my computer can't recognize Oblivion, or er, Oblivion can't recognize my computer because Oblivion is now too old, and my computer too new. But honestly, I like that. There's nothing wrong with well, there he goes. Nothing wrong with playing uh, vanilla Oblivion in 2022. <coughs> That's what uh. <laughs> oh man I'm blanking now because I can't remember but I think it's Namco Bandai who owns Tekken anyway you successfully harvest Harada is what they must see every time a new Tekken comes out I've commented on the <laughs> I've commented or at least thought about how the director of most Tekkens Shares a name with that plant, Harada. But I've never come up with a joke yet. Damn. Finally, at long last, I've come up with a stupid joke. <clears throat> Launch of every new Tekken and Tekken DLC. Tekken and Tekken accessories, you know? Tekken is a fighting game. The director is named Harada, for those who don't know. I'm pretty sure it's Namco Bandai who, uh, who owns the rights. Oh. Yeah, at some point I'm going to have to... Uh... Damn, 2000, huh? I guess I'll save it. Whoa. Is this paralysis? Should I be sipping something? Okay, I got up pretty quick after that, so I think that might be paralysis. Cool. How shitty the texture on the lava is, guys. I really do love how bad that looks. It's just so okay. <laughs> it looks like a big shiny pot of marinara. More so than anything, you know? <laughs> There's, I think it's in Morrowind where, like, 
enchanted items, like, maybe it's a thing where you can't, like, you just can't refill them. But I think there's a mechanic in um, Morrowind where, like, they eventually will fill up over time. They'll get more juice in them. Instead of you socketing more, you know, dumping more stuff in there. Oh, Farwell. It's about time someone got here. What took you so long? God. We are knights sworn to uphold the law. Many wish to join our ranks, as we are of the... Until now, we numbered only seven. But attack... I, I don't care. I set out with the rest of the knights to dispatch this blemish on the face of our fine world. I myself was able to kill perhaps two score of them. But they just kept coming. Only Bremen and I remain alive. However, Bremen. with you here now, we can take the sigil stone from that citadel That's Bremen, and complete guess, huh? our quest for the good of all Chadenhall. Huzzah! <laughs> Are you mad? Now, in my father's name as Count Indorus of Chadenhall, I suggest we use the Raymond Sweep formation. You all right. The path is yours. Lead on. If you die, you die. I don't know what two score is. What's a score? I know that it's just an old-timey way to describe a a number. I just don't know what the exact number is. Well, Farwell slain. How horrible. Oh, man. He didn't fall into lava, did he? Come on, dude. Really, man? <laughs> like poking him with a stick to get all the shit out of his pockets. You're a dark elf. You're supposed to be resistant to flames. It's like your favorite thing. Damn it, Farwell. <laughs> I don't really care. Look, I was in there with him. I saw the whole thing. He's dead. We're both dark elves. That means I should get his job, right? All this, and now Farwell. We should continue. Your We're goofy smile is really dumb. So there were seven initially. We found three dead, including Farwell. Maybe there's a fourth dead I don't know about. Crap. Let's go ahead and uh, do some of this, huh? Or no, wait, it's in here. Let's get this. I don't know if I have the, the juice to trap a, uh, a proper soul. I also don't even know if that counts, you know, because that's like a, that's a summon thing. Cool. What's the man? Getting tired. What's the man? Getting tired. Cool. I find it kind of interesting the way that this game is coded, where like you can of course pick a uh, a weapon up off the floor, like you can find a sword off the floor. Uh, but because of the, the coding stuff, that stuff is not actually in the guy's inventory. 
Like it actually drops as soon as it hits the floor. Oh, the rending halls. That sounds fun. Ah, oh, shit. They're dropping like flies. God damn. That's one of them down. Moonlight, huh? Good movie. I assume. Ooh, he's giving my ass. Hold on now. Wait, you're a melee fighter. You can't possibly outrun me. I'll just run in circles and heal myself. The old Dragon Age 2 standby, huh? Where's he gone? Did he... Did the poison all take effect? Did he keel over? Did he fall in here? <laughs> he did! He did! The poison kicked in! <laughs> That's funny, I like that. Oh, pardon me, sir. Come back here. Oh, that ain't good. Let's do, uh... I think I can see it taking effect on him. I might use this in a bit. Still fond of it. It's a real fight we're in. Okay, one down. Okay. Cool. Damn, crazy. I'll let's do a major one. I'm still pretty sure that that spell like isn't worth it, you know? Like, you're not getting as much juice out of it. Because this is 9 points for 8 health. Yeah, 9 magic for 8 health. And this is 41 magic for 25 health. Like, it's a bigger burst to be sure, but it's kind of not worth it. You know? One of those weird things. And this thing keeps taking hits.
This probably just leads back downstairs. To guys as well. Let's put some, uh... Let's weigh you down. I, I, I find it I find it very amusing that like while fighting I legitimately did like just poison a guy and while his health was was uh while he was bleeding out like I was running away see that's funny I don't care what anyone thinks I find that hilarious. Um, I might do some of these, uh, how you say, like, quests off screen, just cause, like, man, it's gonna be a little bedraggled. Oh no, not my illusion. Take that. Wow, that's fantastic all. Oh. All of those are good. Okay. I kind of like these uh, these towers as layouts. Alright. Let's do the old... Damn it. Hit the wrong guy. Got to the wrong guy. You. They're both bleeding out. I like that. I wouldn't be able to tangle with these uh, with the the Achenok as much if I didn't have all this. Uh, flame resistance, thanks to being a dark elf. Three points for 14 seconds. Three points for 13 seconds. Anything less? I want a small amount. Wow, I've got some good stuff in here. Hmm. No? Okay. That's fine. By the way, I'm aware that this is a... Uh, health sip that I, I can take if I need, but I don't really need it. I think our friend might have keeled over. Where's he at? Oh, you're here. Whatever. Burden, what? Burden of agnosticism. Perhaps agnosticism? Drain Magicka. It's heavy, though. It's a 43-pound mace. It's also mostly empty. Also, draining magic doesn't really matter that much. Not to me. Yeah, I like being a dark elf and just being able to tangle with these fools. Come here. Come here. All right. He certainly seems to be taking the fact of his poisoning pretty... He was like, oh, I've been poisoned, huh? And he leapt into the air. Oh. Cool. Uh, hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Think, think, think. This is back into where I want to be, right? Ah. Look, I've got a lot of points in alchemy. We may as well use them, right? Ah. 
Let's see, 3 times 14 is 42. And that times 3 is 126. So putting three potions that deal that damage onto a guy means that I'm dealing 126 damage plus... What is that, two attack? Because it's very broken, huh? So that means that I'm doing, you know, six damage. Why don't we drink some Restore? I made a lot, you know? May as well use them. So yeah, that's a good combo. I might be able to use two. I, I hadn't really considered that, like, it would be over 100 damage. To me, 100 points is a health is a health bar, you know? Sigilum Sanctus. Sanguis. Sanguis. Let's, uh, let's switch to the axe and, uh, poison that up, huh? Yeah, 3 times 14 is 42. Because there's that other one that's only 13, but... That's only, uh, 39 damage. Still good. Do another one. Alright. That's 84 damage. Of course, I have to wait the full secondage, you know? I guess I could get some blocking, actually. And my uh, my block skill is so goosed right now that I have a... <laughs> Kinval. 4 times 16. That's pretty good, too. can also, um, let's see, drain health. That's in here, right? Oh, it's still a restoration skill. <laughs> I think that's all the juice that I can get out of him. Dramora Longsword, but not a Daedric Sword. Still very heavy. There's something a little fucked up about the game balance of um, uh, Oblivion. And granted, not like this isn't a problem in... Th this definitely is still totally a problem in um, Morrowind, but... Usually weapons are balanced via the weight. Like, the heavier a weapon is, the better it is. But then you also need to have the strength to cart that heavy-ass thing around. But, like, the Dramora stuff you get is good. It's just really heavy. But if you can do things that, like, help with that, then that's fine. Alright, so, uh, no survivors then, huh? Ain't that a shame? Hmm. Uh, make that my active quest. Wow, fantastic. Hey guys, what's going on? Gate guard, any of the leader? Aminus can answer any question. <laughs> oh, you're in the lodge. You're hanging out, huh? Good for you. Did I ever take that level? Son of a bitch. I didn't. Sorry. You've done it! He's dead. Then it's a sad day in Chaden Hall. The knights were boastful louts. Yeah. But they didn't deserve to be killed. I'll stay here and do a final sweep of the area. Your Alright. Count Indoris is waiting. Sorry, I'm looking for the door out. I thought that this was a uh <laughs> I looked at that twice and I was like, that's a... That's not a door, is it? 
Apologies, I believed that it was... Uh, I thought that it was a, um, a window. Just because it looked kind of weird and glowy. Hey, guys. Well met. Yeah, it is. Am I going to get a title for this? Can I uh, take over that guy's job? Yes. Not 8 p.m. yet, but he's still knocked off early. Typical Dark Elves, am I right, guys? I would know. Let's wait for 12 hours. Hey, so your son's dead? <laughs> Sorry, lol. Anyone? Well met. Where's your boss, dude? I need to talk to him. <laughs> you know, I have need of him. Ow! Breaking my legs. Oh, can I make any more potions? Yeah, I got a lot of that, huh? I don't really want to look up a guide on like what I should be combining stuff with in this game. I like this game, but like I don't like it that much. That might be a weird thing to say, but like I'm just unwilling to to want to need to use you know guides. Not even like in the fact that I'm like, I hate using guides because I use them all the time, but like, I just don't have interest in looking up I'm guides for the to alchemy stuff. I'm meet the savior of Chadenhall. And although the death of Farwell saddens me, I know you did the best you could. Yeah. I realize he was trying at times, and he spoke before he thought, but he was still my son, and I adored him greatly. Oh. I'm sure he was difficult to travel with, and I respect your patience. Whereas others would this have is surprisingly die, nice, yeah. I'm sure you fought at his side. We actually did fight together. Your I was willing to fight with him. Your actions are duly noted, and your reward will be in gold. I am sorry for your loss, my lord. I thank you for your sympathy. You're truly a noble individual. Were you able to retrieve anything from him before Oblivion took him? The cash in his pocket and his ring? Please take it. Thank you. You are truly worthy of all the praise being given to you. I salute you. I'll keep the ring as a reminder of. Hmm. Hmm. On second thought, you keep it. You were the last to travel with him, and I feel you deserve it as a memento of your achievement. That's kind of you, sir. I won't take no for an answer. I want you to keep it. I thank you on behalf of all the citizens of Chaden Hall. May RK guide you. Oh, they keep RK here, huh? Um. I will not forget your service to Chaden Hall. Closing the Oblivion Gate outside the city was a daring feat. Yeah. I do not blame you for my son's death. He brought that upon himself. Look at him side-eyeing as, as he's like, yeah, it was kind of his fault. Since the immediate threat to Chadenhall is now eliminated, I will grant your request and send reinforcements to Bruma. Cool. My soldier. All right. Farewell. Did they name him Farwell? Because it's like farewell. As in the old-timey goodbye, you would say to people? Wow. I actually do feel sad about that. That, is, that does suck, you know? But he's, he's frank about it. He's honest. You know? Again, this is still a problem of Oblivion, because Oblivion's voice acting is... Maybe barring Sean Bean. Oblivion is a little cheery of a game, because you can see that like everyone has like these bright, happy eyes and... Borba. I need an armorer, if that's at all possible, fellas. Uh, everyone has these big, bright, happy eyes, and like they all have nice voices. They usually have pretty pleasant voices. Is this free? This isn't a... Yeah, right? The March Rider. Are you a repair shop? Thank you for... What can I interest you in? Here Let we go. Let me take a look at... Yeah, there we go. All right. 
What can I interest you in? The other in? thing is I can repair myself. Wow, that's awesome. Yeah, why not? A bargain at any price. We're kind of getting the money for nothing here. I don't know what I want to spend my money on at all. You know, like, I'm running out of stuff to spend money on. I'm already... Thank you. For... Take care. You know, I'm running dry here. Damn. Uh, I guess I'll well, sell you some potions. Armor, weapons, I can do that off camera, though. Um, yeah, I appreciate that that guy's so frank about it. That was a surprisingly well-read uh, uh, cutscene, you know, quote-unquote. But, like, yeah, this is just a thing with, uh, with, with Oblivion, because, like... Everyone has these big, nice eyes, and they're all goofy. Um, but that's still fine. Um, I had a good time. I hope you did, too. I had a good episode. Um, I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.